I. <laughs> yeah, so I've been sick. It's, it's, I think it's the fourth day now. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. This hasn't been enjoyable. But it is Wednesday, and I found a window of opportunity to go ahead and uh, make that Patreon. Oh, and now I'm making this here. I also uploaded to, uh, well, I mean, the, uh, the, the short for uh, all three of my mains. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I want to be inspirational and shit, but to be honest, I should... <laughs> oh, my head is so stuffed up. Uh, the center of my face has so much pressure in it. Oh, I could cook fucking meat in there. Uh, <laughs> oh, gosh. Can't even do that without feeling the pressure. Ugh. Tell you what, though, time at all extra strength is helpful. NyQuil and DayQuil are helpful. I actually prefer NyQuil and DayQuil, to be honest. I do. I'm going to have some NyQuil tonight. Uh, last night, and I think the night before, I slept pretty well. First two days were ass. <sighs> So yeah, we're just taking it easy, fam. <laughs> we're just taking it real easy. I really want to get onto those commissions because, uh, yeah, I re-upped for some. You know, saying, hey, send all the commissions that you got because I, uh, I need the money. And it's the shortest month out of the year. But like, damn, dude. <laughs> My eye got all fucky before. Not cleared up, I was working, and then I got sick. <sighs> Just ass. Ass, man. Ugh. 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 Had some over-easy eggs, though. Ugh. The first one flipped over pretty easily. The second one did not. And cheese cubes and a bit of spinach. Ugh. Which, honestly, for me, that's basically a peasant's pittance. <laughs> yeah. I'm bad you can eat. So, yeah. Huh. But if I continue to feel better, then, uh... I'll probably... I'll probably pick something up to eat. Yeah. Uh, hopefully none of you guys are sick, but uh, if you are, drink all the fucking... All the water, all the time. All the water, all the time. Help flush that shit out little by little. Uh, especially if you got the, uh... The, what do you call it? Either Pedialyte or its, uh... Equivalents. That'll help too. But, <laughs> because they're packed with vitamins, I suggest only having, like, one... Pedialyte thing a day, and then just a bunch of water after. Um, but if you look in the back of the label for the other brands, you know, sometimes you can drink two of other brands. But as far as I know, like, Pedialyte's just, just overclocking your immune system with a fucking boost, like you just got an adrenaline shot. So yeah, only do one of those. <laughs> you, you can cause problems by having too much of vitamins so don't don't chug gallons of it <laughs> uh, gatorade wouldn't be so bad either uh, mm. it is a little advice for you also anything with vitamin c so you know if uh, you want to eat some apples or any kind of fruit like that make yourself some lemonade you know eat a little bit of uh Actual honey, or whatever, you know, shit like that. I forgot if it was. I forgot if honey was antibacterial or antimicrobial. I don't know. I don't know. I just know honey is good for wounds. 
and it's healthy for you. But yeah, just eat your vitamin C or take your vitamin C tablets, whatever. You'll be fine. Oh. This is sucked ass, dude. <laughs> oh. But you came here to relax. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Because I don't have much energy to do really anything else but relax. So that's what we're going to do. <sighs> wow, that's the first time I've properly yawned without uh, starting a coughing fit. All right, progress. Progress, am I right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, it's actually uh, about 70 indexes right now. I think we're due for another cold front at some point. It's just going to sweep in and probably give us below freezing again. Honestly, the inconsistency of that shit is wild. It's been this way my whole life. Fucking Texas, man. Up and down and crazy motherfuckers. Shit. <laughs> uh. Uh. So what have y'all been up to? Y'all been doing anything good? I mean, we've just been uh, <laughs> laying in bed, trying to feel better, walking around, you know, trying to still get outside. Because that does actually help. It does actually help even when you have a fever, depending on where you're at and your uh, ailment. Even if it's cooler outside or warmer, <laughs> the, uh, the outside, right? Because it's, you know, it's it's an equal temperature all the way around for whatever area you're in. That actually, at least it feels like, to me, uh, it helps regulate your temperature or less, or at least makes you feel a little bit less shitty when you have a fever. It helps me, I don't know, it'd be something to try, you know. I think it would be one of those hit or miss things for people, truthfully. So I say give it a shot. Might as well. You know, whenever you feel shit, you kind of want to try whatever you can to not. <laughs> yeah. The only unfortunate thing about that advice is that I got it from an absolute just waste of semen and breath. Well, the one thing he was ever right about. Uh, but it is good advice. Uh, now I'm passing it on to you, so that way you get it from somebody who's not a waste of semen. <laughs> uh, hmm. Yeah, what have you guys been up to? I've just been chugging water. Electrolyte shit. I haven't even really fucking played games even. I'd like to know if y'all have any projects or... Anything at work that's coming up that you're trying to prepare for, or, you know, whatever have you. If you're trying to uh, start a new hobby, anything like that, really. You know, it'd be nice to hear about. You know, get to engage with y'all some more. Oh. Man, I really want to start on these commissions, but... <laughs> y'all who... Uh, who listen to this to get my commissions. Uh, yeah, with a cough. Uh, and the way my throat is right now, it would be very hard. <laughs> it would be very hard to maintain with how uh, aggressive the character gets. <laughs> it would be very hard to maintain without just hacking all over the place. It's bothering me because I feel like I'm just around the corner from getting better. And it's just like, but but let me like, let me work though. Let me get my shit. <laughs> let me let me complete these commissions for these people. Come on, man. Fuck. Uh, but all in due time. All in due time. 
I've actually been in bed so much that it's starting to be uncomfortable. It's starting to give me uh, one of those, you know, the, the, the back of the neck aches that slowly turns into a headache. So I've been trying to lay on my stomach or walk around for a little bit or something like that. That shit sucks, man. That shit's ass. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Uh. But I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. My D and D dice came in. Yeah. <laughs> uh the the black coral with white and the gold numbers. I'm so happy. If I feel up to it today, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pick him up. Uh, I'm mainly excited because I'm gonna I'm gonna be trying to use them for like bone cracking or like gravel, you know, whatever the cracking can. Well, not cracking, but smacking against each other. I'm gonna try to use that so that way we won't have to like try and find specific individual extremely specific sounds spending hours just trying to track down a single thing it will help a lot even if it's just those two sounds but i think maybe we could also uh edit the sound just enough to make like branches snapping maybe i don't know but it's going to be fun to experiment with that and ow and i can uh you know, be in my first D and D campaign, which will be fun. It'll be, it'll be fun. I think. Yeah. We well, yeah, multi-purpose dice. Yeah, a lot of what I get, I try to make sure I get it uh, with the intent and the idea of all the different purposes it can have. So it really, you know, it really make it worth its money. Well. That's the, that's the best way. If you're going to buy anything that's not, you know, just, what do you call it? Uh, just for the sake of it and you thought it was cool. You know, if you look at stuff and you think about all the things that you could do with it, you know, with your job, your career, your hobby, whatever. It really does get a lot of longevity out of it. And it does help a lot in the long run to, to shop like that. Uh, I mean, there are definitely things that I just want to straight up buy because, damn, that's cool. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. Uh, I would like suits, to be honest. I want an all black suit. Mm. I would love that, truthfully. I really would. Uh, just little tiny accents of gold on it, you know? Like, little uh, gold, the, uh, the cuff buttons, little gold rings on the uh, shoelaces, where they go in and out. I'm not sure what else. Because it would have to be subtle, you know? And it would have to be in places where there can be metallic stuff. Otherwise, it would just look stupid. There are ties that they make uh, that look like they're metallic gold. I think that'd be pretty cool to have. Fucking love black and gold, man. Fucking love that shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd really like that. Without a hat, I'm not really a hat person, but that'd yeah, be kind of neat. You know, to have a, a full get-up three-piece suit with hat. And that little uh, pocket chief. Yeah, that'd be neat. But obviously an actual metal uh, brass, but painted to look like gold. Uh, band around it instead of a ribbon. That'd be cool. Uh, yeah. Like I said, not a lot of gold, but just enough. Just enough to really make it pop. Yeah. That'd be nice. Uh, anyway, I, uh, 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 
I'm going to get up and down the rest of that uh, bottle of liquid vitamins. Oh, you guys have a good day. <laughs> oh. Eat what you like. Treat yourself. And don't forget to take a break. Uh, because pressure may create diamonds, yes, but pressure can also create rubble. So take a break before you break yourself. Much love. Enjoy your day.